Alpha version 0 0.037 of Factory Town has landed. Here's what's new. It's mainly a patch to make the markets tie in better with the new happiness system at the heart of the game. Previously, every so often the market would sell goods you put in it to a house that needed it in exchange for gold, making the house happier. As of the previous update, houses could buy as often as they liked, regardless of need. Letting you earn more gold, but this caused you to run dry of the supplies you needed to keep everyone happy. This update fixes that. Houses will only buy when they have low satisfaction for a good type. However, various things can raise that bar for what is considered low. When a market has surplus, it will sell goods to more satisfied houses. Markets can be upgraded too, which will make them sell to more satisfied houses across the board, allowing you to prioritise earning gold over preserving items, which will be useful as you make more progress in the game. The market inventory has changed too. Now it has space set aside for each specific type of item, preventing the grain lock problems where all of your slots could get filled with low tier items and you wouldn't be able to put the better items in there instead. Houses themselves can buy items as soon as possible if they're delivered directly. And on that subject, you now get input-output indicators when planning shoots and belts near buildings. There's also been a bunch of tweaks to gold prices. Bread is now worth 20, up from 15. Iron plate's gone down to 12 from 20. Enchanted books are up to 50 gold now, and most buildings now cost less gold to make. Eric's also changed how big prices are displayed, so it costs over a thousand will display as 1k or whatever. And a couple of bug fixes. Houses stay fully satisfied while they're consuming an item now. Uh, houses shouldn't switch off anymore, requiring manual intervention to make them actually buy goods. The final house upgrade should be working. And the Forester is now going to actually display its correct worker bonus. There was also a OSX version released, so if you're already in the Alpha and have a Mac, you can give that a try. That's about everything. Let's go stress test this. <laughs> <laughs>